Hello everyone. Today in this video I will show how to use YOLO5 phase module locally in your environment. Here is the original repository. Authors of this repository is not active and not accepting pull requests. So I decided to make a fork of this repository. I fixed various bugs and warnings that I found and made the compatible code with the latest PyTorch version which is 2.1 also i created a releases page which can be used to download original pre-trained modules and convert it on the next modules here it is however i unable to download a large module because uh, google drive link is expired and unable to download module from baidu link so everyone who able to download this module Please uh, write comment in your uh, YouTube or create a issue in my repository. So we can start to use this module. First of all, you need to clone this repository. You can use a link here. And after that, you need to install required packages. I created a requirements txt file which contains all required packages list. And then you can run a simple command to install these requirements. I already did this. Next, you need to download a module. Here is a list of all available modules. Currently, I downloaded this module. I created a readme file, which instructions. Uh, to detect faces in an image, you need to run this command. It contains three simple parameters. First parameter specified path to the weights, second parameter specified image path, and third parameter specify that we need to save resulting image. Now we can run this command locally in my environment to see what happens. Command outputs that two faces are detected. To see image, we need to go to runs directory. And here is the image with detected faces. Also, I'm providing other instructions. Here is the instructions to evaluate module using wider face uh, dataset. Also, I'm providing comments to export PyTorch module to an NX format. And also, I'm providing uh, comments to train modules from scratch. And that's all, guys. If you have any, any questions, Please write comment in YouTube channel or create issue in GitHub repository. See you the next time.